The dog's bell. John's dog was a bad dog. He bit people frequently. John had great concern about this. It was not an appropriate way for a dog to behave. His friends in the village always expected the dog to bite them. The news about John's dog spread through the village. None of the people wanted to go to John's house. John tried to instruct the dog to behave, but it never worked. He tried to be patient and teach the dog to be calm. That also didn't work. John didn't want to punish the dog. How will I stop my dog's bad habit? John asked himself. John's friend came to talk to him about the issue. During their important meeting, his friend said, The people in the village asked me to represent them. We want your dog to stop this habit. Why don't you put a bell around the dog's neck? This way we would hear your dog coming down the street. John thought this was a great idea. Now, people could stay away from the dog. It would not be able to bite anyone anymore. The dog liked the bell, too. People looked at him when they heard his bell. This made the dog very content. He liked the song the bell played when he walked. One day, John's dog strolled through the village and met some other dogs. He expected them to want a bell like his, but they laughed at his bell. They said the bell made people avoid him. John's dog shook his heed. No, they look at me because they like the bell. The other dog said, You have the wrong idea of what makes you popular. Of course they like your bell. It tells them where you are so they can avoid you. You aren't able to bite them anymore. You see, being popular isn't something positive when it's for the wrong reason. Frequently, this word means often or at regular intervals and refers to something that occurs frequently or repeatedly. Concern. It can be a noun or a verb. As a noun, it means a feeling of worry or interest in something. As a verb, it means to cause worry or to be interested in something. Appropriate. This word is an adjective that means suitable, fitting, or proper for a particular situation or purpose. Behave. This verb means to conduct oneself in a particular way, typically in accordance with accepted social norms or rules. Village. A village is a small community or settlement, often in a rural area that is smaller than a town or city. Expected. This word refers to something that is anticipated or predicted to happen or be received in the future. Spread. It can be a noun or a verb. As a noun, it means the act of extending over a larger area. As a verb, it means to extend over a larger area or to distribute something widely. None. This word means not any or no one among a group of people or things. Instruct. This verb means to teach or direct someone to do something by giving them information or orders. Patient. This word has two meanings. As a noun, it refers to a person receiving medical treatment. As an adjective, it means the ability to remain calm and not become annoyed or anxious, especially in difficult situations. Calm. An adjective that describes a state of peacefulness, tranquility, or absence of disturbance. Punish. This verb means to impose a penalty or consequence on someone for wrongdoing, typically to teach a lesson or maintain order. Habit. A habit is a routine or behavior that is regularly followed, often occurring without conscious thought. Issue. This word can have various meanings, but it generally refers to a topic or problem that is the subject of discussion, debate, or concern. Represent. This verbi means to stand for or symbolize something, often as a delegate or spokesperson. Content. As an adjective, it means satisfied or pleased with what one has or is. As a noun, it refers to the material within something, such as the content of a book or a website. Strolled. This is a past tense verb form of stroll, which means to walk in a leisurely and relaxed manner. Avoid. This verb means to keep away from or prevent oneself from doing something or being in a particular situation. Shook. This is the past tense of the verb shake, which means to move back and forth or vibrate rapidly. Positive. This word can have several meanings, 
but it generally refers to something that is characterized by optimism, confidence, or affirmation. And your reason.